promise me we do this together, okay? I promise. Every day it's a little harder as I feel my power grow. Don't you know there's part of me that loves to go into the unknown? Into the unknown. So, update. But I got a little bit distracted there for a sec. Just a little bit distracted, okay? I'm back. I'm back now. I'm, I'm back. I'm not going to watch it again in five minutes. It's not going to happen. Don't worry about it. I believe in you, Elsa. More than anyone or anything. It's, it's, it's not, I'm not going to watch it. Anyway, update. My ear is fucked. Yeah, this one's okay. It did get a little bit infected. I ended up going back down to the original size. This one, on the other hand, got fucked up. If you want a close up, here's a close up of the carnage. I call it, I call it my zombie ear because it looks like a zombie ear right now. I have been gauging my ears since 2011. I was like so stoked. They were so little at first and they just kept getting bigger and bigger and I love them. I love my gauges so much. And I hadn't sized up for like two years so I was like, I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna go up to the next size. I did that, but after like two days, my ear just flared the fuck up. It was like this much bigger. It was huge, super red, pussing everywhere. It was disgusting. After I'd taken it out and I woke up the next day, I almost just broke down right there and started crying. I love my gauges. I am so, so sad about it. Like, this really sucks for me. It's possible that I'll have to go, I mean, depending on how it heals, I might just have to go get surgery to get it closed up. I am not happy about it at all. I'm, I'm gonna leave this one in. Uh, I can't give them both up. <laughs> I can't do it. I guess I'll just be extra unique because I'll be all asymmetrical. I don't know. The second issue that we have here is that I just moved to Michigan. I've been applying to a bunch of jobs and now I have to put that off because I have fucking zombie ear that's just gonna stare him in the face during an interview. I'll just look at them like this. I'll have a conversation with them like this, just the whole time. And then if I ever have to like turn my head, I'll just be like this. Like, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm so asymmetrical. <laughs> Part two of this update is, as you can see, I am still in a hotel room. Hopefully by Wednesday, I will have all of my stuff back. I will be moving into our new apartment. I'm just really excited to have my stuff and to have a room to sleep in again. So back to the job. I talked about it a little bit with in regards to zombie ear. I need this, I need a job to make money, but I need a car to get to my job, but I need a job to get a car. I applied to just some bullshit jobs at Best Buy and they've turned me down on like all of them. I mean, I only applied for the full-time jobs and I know they only want part-timers at Best Buy. They don't want full-time people because you have to give them benefits and all that bullshit. It's whatever. It's whatever. You know what? It's fine. Don't hire me, Best Buy. Don't hire me. My life hasn't been centered around technology for the last, you know, so many years. Like, I really just have no idea. So don't hire me, Best Buy. Don't hire me. I'm no good. I have no idea what I'm talking about, really. Like, all of your employees that you have right now, they're like way smarter than me. <laughs> I'm salty. <laughs> I know so many things about technology. I can tell you what the difference between an OLED and an LED is, and I can bet you that half of your fucking employees have no fucking clue what the difference is. They're just like, oh, OLED is really pretty, and LED is pretty, but not as pretty. Lord save me. It's just, wow, my hair looks like shit. Why didn't anybody tell me this already? Wow, I look like, I look like dog dude. Look at my ear. Ugh. So yep, that's it. That's my update. Woo, yeah, still don't have any things. Woo, yeah, still got my ear fucked up. Still don't have a job. <sighs> there is one thing I should mention, one last thing. My mental health has been all right. I've been okay. I just don't go outside anymore. So in my mind, I haven't left California, right? I'm not looking at the weather. I don't I don't want to see 50 degrees. I don't want to fucking see it. So I'm just, I'm pretending. I'm pretending that it's 90 outside and I just haven't been outside because it's just really hot outside, you know? And I just don't want to get all sweaty, so. That's it. Peace and love.